Welcome to another video and here we are with Samsung once again and today we are going to demonstrate how to become a member of the One UI beta program. Now we're going to be doing this on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6 today since this is available for this device now. So in order to get started you're going to want to be in the Samsung members application. You can just do a search through your apps for the Samsung Members app. And it'll look something like this once you open it. Then we're going to look for, I would say the advertisement or the card for the One UI beta program in this instance. And we're going to tap on it. And here we can register for this program. So we're going to see this big card here. We're going to tap join now. Now before we go any further, there is going to be some information about the program here that you may want to read just to get a little bit more information about what the program is and what is going on here. Also on the previous page, you're also going to have similar information there. But again, moving on, we have the enroll button at the bottom here. We're going to tap on it and then we're going to tap continue again. And then we just had that brief notification here that registration can take up to 10 minutes. Now, as for the registration taking up to 10 minutes, that could be receiving the download as well. Now, while we're waiting for that download to come through, if you wanna withdraw from the program, you'll go to this page once again, and you'll still tap the join now, interesting enough. And then you'll have the option to withdraw from the program here as well. Now, while we're waiting, another thing we can do is I am going to navigate to my settings here and then I'm going to scroll all the way down until we see software update, tap on that, and then we're going to tap on download and install and see if maybe that update will come through this way. It's more of a manual way to force it. And here we are. That's actually what I would recommend because you might be waiting a while. So now you can see that we are downloading the update. I wanna see if we have a download size here. So here we're going to have our update information, One UI version 7.0, Android version 15, just some more version information. The size is going to be right here as well if you're interested in that. And then we also have the security patch level right there as well. Now, once the beta is downloaded, we can tap install now. Now, this looks like it's going to restart your device, just something to keep in mind. So if there was anything you were doing on your phone, you want to make sure that you do save it or uh, upload it to the cloud or anything like that. So it looks like we're finishing up here. And I will say that to install this update, it did take a bit of time here I would say uh, five minutes or so but again it looks like we're finishing up and here we are it looks like we are practically done I'm going to log into my device here and I can already tell we have some different sounds here system sounds uh, things look a little bit different here we're going to have the welcome one UI 7.0 so uh, we're going to tap on start here so I can see that our battery meter or battery indicator, that's also going to look different. We're going to get some information on Galaxy AI. We're going to have this instant access notifications and quick settings. Wonder if we can check any of that. You can't check any of that at the moment, it looks like. We're going to tap next. And then we have a notice here that this is beta software. So it just lets you know that there may be occasional errors, uh, backup important data and any errors that are found are used to improve future versions so we'll tap ok and then you can dive deeper into this to see what's new but we're going to tap home and i can already tell there are some things that do look a little different here i'm trying to get a screen rotation and i'm going to see if i can pull up a screen recorder here so one of the first things i'm going to notice here i do like my widgets so some of these widgets look a little different like this one here this is a battery widget for all my connected devices, uh, the, and that also includes the Galaxy Z Fold 6. We're going to have our storage widget here. That's also different. I think some of these widgets might also be shaped a little different. We still maintain our stacked widgets though, which I really like, I'm a big fan of that. The other thing I also notice here is when you swipe down from the middle, you get your notifications there. 
If you swipe down from the left, uh, you still get notifications. If you swipe down from the right, that's going to pull up all your quick settings. And those also look a little bit different as well. I'm going to try this again here. I'm just swiping here to see if anything. Interesting enough, if you swipe left or right, you can toggle between your notifications and your quick settings. Uh, but I also think the quick settings might look a little different as well. That's interesting. This has more of a OnePlus vibe to it. It's like they borrow some ideas. But there are some small differences. The internet icon looks different. I'm going to swipe up here. Uh, just some minor differences upon first inspection. But that is it. That is how you become a member of the One UI beta program, how to install it, about how long it takes. It does take a little bit of time. You wanna set maybe 15 to 20 minutes aside to do this. And these are the small changes I noticed for the One UI 7 beta program. So that is it for today's content. As always, thanks for watching and may the universe flow in your favor. And until next time, Leon checking out. Yeah. Yeah.